Hi, I'm Jason, the Wealth Advisory Lead at Scythe. Today, I would like to introduce to you the Downside Protected Portfolio by Scythe, the first of its kind in Singapore. This portfolio enables you to capture upside potential of the S&P 500 while protecting against the downside losses. This portfolio has two attributes to take note of, estimated max loss and current upside cap. Let me elaborate. The portfolio is constructed using a new series of innovative ETFs, which utilize option strategies that provide a high level of protection against the downside losses. As the S&P 500 goes down, the losses of the portfolio will be limited to approximately estimated max loss level. To reduce the expense of downside protection, the strategy sets a current upside cap on returns. This means that as the S&P 500 trends higher, the portfolio returns will be initially limited to the cap level. Take for example, a downside protected portfolio with an estimated max loss of 5% and a current upside cap of 12%. Let's explore how this portfolio will perform in three hypothetical scenarios. Firstly, in a negative market, if the market drops significantly, for instance, S&P 500 drops by 20%, this portfolio will typically incur a loss of around 5%, protecting your investment from further declines. In a positive market, let's say the S&P 500 gains 10%, which is within the upside cap of 12%. Your portfolio will be up 5% potentially and moving towards the upside gains in the index. And in a booming market, where the S&P 500 soars above 20%, your portfolio will likely achieve the upside cap of 12%. And this brings me to the next feature of the portfolio, auto rebalancing. On top of the downside protection, we offer periodic rebalancing that allows you to lock in the portfolio gains while continuing to capture the upside potential. As the gains reach closer to the current upside cap, we rebalance the portfolio and we revise the current upside cap higher. And this is achieved by replacing the constituent ETFs with those offering a higher return cap. Coming back to the earlier hypothetical scenario, in a booming market, with rebalancing, the current upside caps are then revised higher beyond the 12%, hence allowing you to capture higher upside potential. This added auto rebalancing feature makes the downside protection portfolio an evergreen alternate portfolio for you to invest in. So who should consider the downside protected portfolio? One, if you are generally risk adverse and you prefer to minimize your potential losses while still capturing upside potential, a downside protected portfolio is ideal. Two, for those of you who have been on the sidelines and are holding excess cash currently, this portfolio offers an excellent solution. Transitioning to a downside protected portfolio can allow you to enter the equity markets with greater confidence. And lastly, if you are currently invested in the US markets but are unsure about the market's direction, you can consider switching to a downside protected portfolio instead of exiting the market completely. Before you invest, please refer to our investment strategy the downside protected portfolio or reach out to the advisory team to better understand the strategy and risk. Thank you.